NGB 特許ワールドツアーブラジル編のナビゲーターを務めます NGB の牛島と申しますどうぞよろしくお願いします私は、えー、特許第2部第4グループというところで、えー、一般科学製薬それから食品のメーカーさんと一緒にですねお仕事をさせていただいております本日の訪問先はブラジルのダニエル事務所ですダニエル事務所はですね60年以上の歴史を持つ事務所で、えー、弊社とも長い付き合いがあります2018年にですね、えー、共に共催のセミナーをさせていただいたりですとか、えー、今でもすごく仲良くさせていただいている事務所になりますそれではダニエル事務所に向かいましょうそれではまず、えー、ダニエル事務所について伺ってみたいと思います Mr. Gosain, could you please introduce yourself and your firm? At the outset, I would like to first thank Mr. Takahashi and NGB's management for granting the opportunity、uh, and invitation to participate in NGB Patent World Tour. On behalf of our law firm, Daniel Law, I thank you. Very much for this opportunity. My name is Ranega Sain. I'm a senior partner in the firm, Daniel Law Firm. I have a technical background and I became an attorney in 2005. I have over 35 years of expertise in intellectual property with a strong focus on patents, pharmaceuticals, and design practice. In law.、Uh, my role is, is to,、uh, I am the contact person for Asian countries, especially Japan, Korea, China. I also do a lot of traveling and I manage on behalf of the firm many portfolios of 500 Fortune companies.、Uh, the law firm, Daniel, Daniel Law, Was established in 1959. At that time, we were known as Daniel Advogados. We are a leading intellectual property firm in Brazil, and we have grown in a very responsible way, but we have grown a lot.、Uh, our business is managing intellectual property portfolios. We do almost everything in terms of intellectual property patent prosecution, trademark prosecution. IP litigation, licensing, everything that, that is related to intellectual property. We are proud that we have、uh, enacted diversity policies in our firm, which we take very seriously. And、uh, we represent, as I mentioned before, a big market share of US clients, Japanese clients, Korean clients, European clients. So,、uh, We are proud to be、uh, working with NGB, whom we have a relationship with over 45 years. Mr. Gusain, could you share with us some changes in intellectual property in your country? Yes, of course. I will respond to that question in two parts.、Uh, when we developed, the Brazilian government developed a backlog strategy plan.、Uh, the backlog applications at that time were over 150,000 cases spent in examination. And during the last two years,、uh, the PTO has worked successfully to reduce that backlog. Currently, there are only 82,000 cases, which means there has been a 45% reduction during the last two years in particular. To give you an example, in 2015, the average prosecution delay、uh, stood at 10 years. That means from the filing to the issuance of a patent, the applicant had to wait. An enormous time around 10 years. 
now, currently, with the strategy plan to combat the backlog, the patent office has successfully reduced this term to roughly 7.3 years. Another piece of important information is that after the office action is published in the official bulletin under the code 6.21, the patent office will usually publish the allowance of that application within eight months time. So you can see how things have changed in a short period of time, roughly two years. Now, what really, what really was the most important tool was the creation of an office action, which is called the preliminary standardized office action. And that was the tool the patent office adopted to reduce the backlog. They have been issuing office actions on cases that were filed in December 2016. And it was a very simple office action. The applicant is requested to submit prior art, which has been uncovered in the search. And uh, the Brazilian and, and the Brazilian attorney uh, to answer that office action, to respond to that office action, will submit uh, comments on the prior art. And then after he can adapt the Brazilian claims to those of a corresponding patent which has issued. And in very short period of time, the application will be allowed. So that that was the secret, that is the secret and one of the most, I think, powerful uh, measures that the patent office came up with. In addition to that, over the last two, three years, there were several expedited examination procedures, what we call fast track measures. One of them is the green patent, which became as a pilot program and became, and became a definite provision. And under the green patent provisions, a patent application can proceed to grant within two years time. Another situation is pharma in the pharma area. If you have a pharma application covering a neglected disease, or a cancer drug, or any important HIV-related product, uh, the applicant can request the patent office to expedite examination. Another measure is, the, is that if you're a, a, a senior citizen and as an applicant, you're entitled to get uh, your examination, your application examined as quickly as possible due to your age as a senior citizen. That means if you're over 60 years, uh, you can benefit from this provision. One other fast track measure is the PPH, which has been widely used. And Brazil has signed agreements with, with Japan, the US, the UK, the Danish patent office, and recently the Korea patent office has signed provisions, PPH agreements with Brazil. The good news is that now the technologies are neutral, meaning there is no limit, limitation to technologies. All technologies can benefit from PPH. And this is a very efficient and fast procedure. And you can get your, if you follow the rules, you can get your patent within two years time. So as you can see, there are several measures, but the most important when I repeat is the the preliminary standardized office action, which has to be issued by the Brazilian Patent Office. The other measures that I mentioned, uh, the applicant has to request the Patent Office to benefit from PPH, to benefit from the green patents, to benefit from senior citizens. All of that depends, is, depends on the applicant's request. So these are the, in a, a very brief, maybe six to seven minutes. This, these are the measures that the patent office have adopted and it has been proven to be successful. So I think we are experiencing something that we have never seen for the last 30 years. Uh, we expect that at the end of 2021, I think most of the backlog will be eliminated. Thank you, Mr. Gosain. Thank you very much for your attention and thank you very much for the opportunity to speak to NGB Patent World Tour. Bye-bye.
以上ですね終了となりますけれどもご質問等ございましたらいつでもお気軽に弊社までお問い合わせくださいそれではさようなら